morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Good morning. my people. Stop trying to film my intro. Good morning, my people. You guys are bouncing on my new spin bike. Woo! Time to spin. Woo woo! I'm trying to annoy Cody. But he's downstairs and he can't hear me. I was supposed to get this bike tomorrow. I'm so excited because I don't know, like I never really like kind of showed it on my stories. I kind of talked about my YouTube. I kind of talked about it a little bit. I have been really into spin. So I got a spin membership in February, like the beginning of February. And then I did it all through February. And then I did it like the like little bit of March that we had. I did like the last class before quarantine. And so I've really missed it. I've been out of it for a few weeks now and I really miss it. So I ordered myself a spin bike. I got like a cheap one on Amazon. I'll link it down below if you guys are curious. I'm not sponsored and I, I wish that I didn't have to pay for this with my own money. But I did, but uh, I'll give you guys my honest feedback on it. I'm gonna do a little workout on it today, film it for you guys, and we'll see how it is. But it had pretty good reviews, and it was only like, I think it was like $3.99. We're gonna put this together. The reviews said people put it together in like 10 minutes, so I'm hoping it'll be pretty simple. I'm so excited. Ah. <laughs> Okay guys, apparently I have the wrong bike. I did not order this one. Uh, Amazon just called me, so we're gonna bring this back outside for him, and he's gonna bring me my real bike. I almost opened it too. I definitely don't want one like this. <laughs> I didn't even look at it. Wow, okay, back we go to your new friend. At least someone had the same idea as me. Fitness. Okay, now we're in business. This one is freaking heavy. This is what it should look like. We get the workout in before the workout. Woo! This is our warm up. So I'm thinking this setup will be like right here by the window. That's what I'm thinking. Then I could just work out next to my dogs. I could set up my little like tripod right here. I think it'll be perfect. Now <laughs> we're gonna set up the correct bike. Can you imagine if I took everything out and started assembling it? That would have been horrible. So super excited. Yay! It's like pretty small, which I actually like since it's at home. Wow. It comes with some tools. So we're gonna set this up. We got a bunch of stuff in here. Wow. Here we go. So I uh, called Cody from downstairs to help me. <laughs> She's gonna make some coffee and then we're gonna figure this out because I'm really bad at assembling things, you guys. Like it's probably one of my worst qualities. So supposedly we took this Allen wrench and unscrew a few screws because it has legs on it, you think, Cody? They're temporary legs. What does that mean? You put an actual legs on there. Like, they're just for shipping. Oh, okay. Jazzy, get on my face, I'm trying to make a bike. You being needy? Yeah, you being needy, mamas. Already putting Cody to work. <laughs> <laughs> we like just woke up a little bit ago. Here we go. What do you mean I didn't wake up? What are you talking about? I've been working, girl. <laughs> I've been working. Okay, I just woke up. Um, and it removes the four washers, shipping rear tube and shipping front tube. It's just this bottom part. Oh. What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Why are you That's all right, yeah, everybody. I need these instructions. Don't need our instructions, okay? <laughs> you need to treat. These are not <laughs> no. no. That's what me and Jackson are doing, Mike. 
Cody sets it up. <laughs> how, did I just, how did I just get like put into this to where now I'm doing it? <laughs> Jackson needs cuddles, so I'm busy. Are we gonna do a spin workout today? Oh, are we gonna do a spin workout today? Oh, are we gonna do a spin workout today? Boop, boop, boop. I'm gonna sit here and act like I'm doing something. Did you know that this is how it would end up? Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. You want to tell my channel how bad I am at assembling things? Literally, I don't like to read instructions. <laughs> like, no, I'll do it my own way. <laughs> yeah, I know. Oh. Yeah. Together. It feels like Christmas. Oh my god, this is where you put the water bottle? This is so cool on the side. Yeah. What? 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 <laughs> Jackson. What? He said, he said, where? <laughs> where? Can I take a ride? <laughs> Can I take a ride? Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Excuse me. He's like, oh, <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Can I have a kiss? Right, we are almost done, so I think the only thing left is the handlebar, which Cody's doing right now. Yeah, I'm so excited. I love the sides of it. I feel like it's perfect for like a living room. Yeah, it's not bad. I like, really like it. Jazzy! Hi, Jazz. You say hi to YouTube or are you going to be sassy? Hello. My name's Jasmine. <laughs> Because at my spin class, I'm pretty high up on this. Like, I can barely get on it. Oh, that's because there's no shoes. guys so on instagram they do like live spin classes so i'm gonna take one right now and do a spin class and kind of just get back on a bike it's been a while since i've done it so i'm really excited i'm outfit on this is all new brianna k collection super excited these sand leggings give me life they're like my favorite leggings ever i got my weights i got my water and i'm gonna take a class oh i just slowed down i don't want to sweat <laughs> my hair's i missed sweating. the part yeah it came up yeah. i was doing jumps so weird Wait for a combo, I want to show you so bad. We're about to go again, look at my heart rate. What's it at? 169, it's one of the best workouts I've ever done. Oh, it's just me sprinting. I just don't worry, but... I'm going down for four counts and then back up. Now two. What do you think about this, Jay? What do you think? You think? Watch this. Mom, you crazy. Let's go. Let's go. Give me eight more. Woo! I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> My hair is wet from that spin class. It was so much fun though. I just have my hair in a little tight bun. I need to go downstairs and get some work done. I'm kind of getting a late start to work today. I mean, I guess I'm always kind of working like on my phone and stuff because like Instagram and all that's like my main job, I guess you could say. So it's one o'clock, so I'm going to make a coffee and I thought I could show you guys. So I didn't finish my last coffee. Instead of warming it up, I'm just gonna make a fresh one since I'm at home. We're gonna go into how I make my coffee. So uh, I have the Breville machine I got from Amazon like a little over a year ago. So it looks like this. First thing you wanna do, I need to make sure 
there's like no beans in there. So we're gonna grab some beans. Things that I really like are the Stumptown brand. Um, so these are just like whole beans. So I'm gonna fill up this part with beans. Once you've added your beans, obviously make sure there's water in the back too. I feel like this is all common sense. Take my little, I don't know what to call this, and I make sure it's on double because we don't do single in this house. We only do double. Okay. So it'll fill up for you. Next up, take your tamp. It's out. We're going to kind of just like, I kind of like just push all the coffee beans like inside this little I don't know what to call this, inside this thing. And then you just push down once, really hard, kind of twist a little bit. Okay, so here is your espresso shot, yummy. Should be a nice like tan color on the top. Okay, this is something that I don't normally do if I have the right almond milk, but like I told you guys in my Trader Joe's haul, this is not my favorite almond milk. This is unsweetened, so it's super bitter. So what I like to do is I add to my milk frother, I add just like a little bit of this vanilla syrup. I would say only use this if you have unsweetened almond milk because regular almond milk does have some sugar in it and I don't need it at all. Like I don't like my coffee too sweet. So I just kind of cover the bottom. You fill up the milk to right where it hits like that crease right there. For the milk, I place it right there and I just like barely have it hanging out. You don't want it to make that really loud like wishing noise because then it's gonna froth too much. You start to see that spinning and just leave it there okay for our almond milk you don't want to get too hot or it's gonna have like that really like nutty taste so just get it where it's like warm to your, t your hands but it's not like burning you then i'm not the best at this but cody always goes like in a circular motion and then i kind of stop and then i'll just like drizzle whatever kind of design that i'm feeling you know which is never a design it's usually just a bunch of scribbles so it's fine and the finished product should look like this a nice delicious latte all from home so i always do almond milk with vanilla if the almond milk again is sweetened i do not use the vanilla so a super simple coffee that you can make at home it literally tastes like you're going to a cafe without the price of a cafe you know